data is the fuel that drives Safaricom's quest to transform lives by connecting people and providing opportunities and information. From financial services anchored on M-Pesa to the internet offerings that power our increasing online lives, data is king. A world-class data center translates to a superior all-round experience for a Safaricom customer. As part of its strategy to transform from a telecommunications company to Africa's leading purpose-led technology company by 2030, Safaricom is constructing three Tier 3 Plus data centers. The first one is in Red Hill, Limuru in Kiambu County. For the customer, it gives them a number of benefits, key among them being uh, stability and resiliency for services like M-Pesa, whereby they can be able to do many more transactions per second without encountering any problems. We also have automated systems, so customers can be able to do queries as well as get solutions at the touch of a button. The first phase of the Limuru data center is complete. Eventually, the center will have three phases and is expected to impact Safaricom customers and the organization's operations in general. This facility has enabled us to be able to now move to the next level of our data center strategy and ensure that we are uh, becoming better and better. We keep ensuring that the customer is comfortable with us and we are giving them the right products and they keep becoming more uh, affordable as we, as we keep um, uh, operating efficiently, ensuring that our energy costs are efficient, ensuring that we are always available, and ensuring that the tech capabilities they need in AI, in machine learning, in cloud computing, are actually being, uh, being availed to them. The choice of Lemuru was strategic, as it can be accessed from various directions, enabling rapid maintenance. Limuru is also not prone to flooding, eliminating danger from water. Limuru's cool climate and clean air flow allow free cooling, which reduces energy costs. To ensure energy efficiency, the data center supplements power from the grid with solar energy. Furthermore, the Data Protection Act 2019 requires that personal identifiable data be hosted in a data center located in the country, so Limuru also helps tick a legal box. We own the land in Limuru, so having a data center of our own and uh, having our key systems that handle customer data uh, within our very own facility, it actually uh, helps us comply to the Data Protection Act. Everything has been taken care of to ensure that the data for our customers is completely protected and we can guarantee that. The Safaricom Limuru Data Center is an ambitious project designed for future growth. The facility will host Safaricom's internal IT infrastructure, M-Pesa, as well as an innovation lab that will help the company test the new techno ideas before they are launched. Large cloud providers like AWS, Microsoft and Oracle can also be hosted on-site. This is a fit for future uh, facility and one of the aspects is um, in terms of capacity, uh, that's power capacity. At the end of the second phase that we are currently running, that will be uh, ready by the end of, uh, by January 2026, we will be a 2.8 megawatts facility. So in terms of rack power uh, that is needed to drive AI, compute power and storage, it means we are ready. The people aspect of it is what is key and the relationship that we built. We are about to do another phase and you can still see the energy from the team wanting to do another phase and another phase. So uh, putting all aside the AI, the technology, the everything, the human aspect is what is important to build such a facility. Data center tiers are a standardized ranking system issued by the Global Uptime Institute that indicates a data center's reliability and performance. The lowest tier is 1 and the highest is 4. So in terms of uh, power resiliency, this is a tier 3 certified data center with an uptime of 99.982%. Uh, as well as uh, it has uh, cooling systems that are, are able to handle uh, high capacity racks. And overall, in terms of efficiency, uh, it is one of the best uh, in this country. 
So when we call it world class, yeah, we've already been tested in terms of best practices and industry standards. And that means we play in the same league with Google, with Microsoft. Data centers are key to meeting Africa's appetite for digital services, fueled by the world's largest youth population and supported by moves to bring critical services like education, healthcare, agriculture, finance and governance online.